When Prince William shook the hands of New Yorkers and visitors during his visit to the city today, he won their hearts. A British woman was told by the Prince of Wales that he would love to return with his family and that they had brought the Brazilian weather with them. William even made light of the rowdy behavior of a group of 60-year-old women who were on a combined birthday celebration trip. Barb Patterson, 60, was one of the visitors from Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada. She stated, he promised not to inquire about your age. I mentioned that I'm 60. Let's say 50, he remarked. William greeted people, posed for selfies, and inquired about their origins while grinning and laughing. One woman called her mother and showed her that William was only a few feet away, making her scream in horror as he moved along the line of people. He claimed he wanted to come back with Kate and the kids, according to a British woman who implored William to return. The walkabout took place in front of FDNY 10 House, a firehouse located next to the World Trade Center. Laura Kavanaugh gave William a tour of the area for 30 minutes, showing him places like the 9-11 Monument and a plaque honoring the station's six fallen firefighters. But even a royal visit couldn't escape New York life, and when he was inside the fire station, a rat ran across the front. Prior to joining forces at the Earthshot Summit, William met in New York with former Microsoft CEO Bill Gates and Prince Albert of Monaco. In order to discover how other world leaders are addressing environmental challenges, the Prince of Wales visited with other royals while wearing a traditional suit and slender tie. When it was time to announce the Earthshot winners, he went on stage and explained that he had started his day by running in Central Park and that the epidemic and the Queen's passing had prevented him from arriving in New York City earlier. He remarked, I made the decision to join the throngs of New Yorkers doing their morning routine in Central Park. Instead of the rain we got yesterday, it was fantastic to wake up in Central Park on a Sunday morning, he continued. Getting some fresh air was lovely, and coming back has been amazing. I believe that 2014 marked the last time I visited New York. I have been attempting to return, but the deaths of my grandmother and COVID last year have prevented me from doing so. He went to a fire station to meet with first responders after announcing the Earthshot Award winners. William was without his wife, Princess Kate, who visited a youth centre in East London.